watches are becoming more and more important on sailboats. A properly working clutch allows you to hold the line in the position you want while freeing up a winch for another maneuver. Rope clutches also help you keep your deck clear and your lines well organized. Although today's modern sailing lines have extremely high working loads, lines can and do break. Quite often, when a line breaks, it breaks at the contact point of the clutch. For a clutch to properly function, it's very important that it does not damage the line. In other words, it's important to choose a clutch that not only has high holding strength, but also one that will not damage your lines. Line care is essential if a clutch is being used in substitute of a winch. For a clutch to function, it needs to create pressure on the line. An increase in pressure results in an increase of holding strength. The mechanical solution of a clutch is ideal for its function. Inside, you'll find a cam that rotates out of its center. This way, the more pressure I put on the line, the more the cam presses the line onto the base. Holding strength is produced simply and automatically. You never want your line to break, but at the same time, you don't want to sacrifice the holding strength of your clutch. Clutch manufacturers must always take into account these two factors. One need to find the balance to avoid both line damage and slippage. Let's discuss slippage first. The design must allow the highest control of the line possible. I can stop a line by concentrating the grip on a reduced volume of the line, or I can stop a line by controlling a greater area of the line. To increase the grip, we don't use a flat base, but instead we use a curved base, which distributes the load of the cam evenly through the maneuver. To avoid slippage, one may suggest using a cam with a rough surface. If that were the case, however, we would then be discussing line damage. Our objective was to design a clutch that would not only hold the line, but one that would also avoid damage to the line cover. How did we do that? Instead of stopping a line with a rough surface, I can stop a line with a smoother yet wider surface. Antal uses a V-shaped cam with two faces as opposed to a flat single-faced cam. Pressure is then produced on a much wider surface, covering three sides of the line as opposed to traditional cams which cover only two. We call this the V-grip system. Antal manufactures different sizes of clutches that are fitted with the V-grip system. The smallest is the V-CAM 611. This clutch is available for 6 and 8 mm lines, with both a plastic or aluminum handle. In the medium-sized clutch range, we have the V-CAM 814. The 814 is available for 8 to 10, 10 to 12, or 12 to 14 mm lines. Again, with both a plastic or aluminum handle. Finally, in the larger clutch range, we have the V-Grip Plus and the Maxi, which hold up to 16 and 22 mm lines. All of these clutches are fitted with the V-Grip system and show excellent test results on modern line materials, such as the composite polyester and Kevlar covers. All clutches have the ability to pull the line through with the handle and the cam in the closed position. The line stops in the new position with no slippage. In an emergency, it's possible to release the line under load without the use of a winch. The handle allows you to do so even when the line is under pressure. Of course, this must only be done when you have no alternative, since the load on the line at the moment is very high. At Antal, we design everything ourselves, and this is one of the most rewarding experiences. Once we came up with the idea for the CAM 814, all we had to do was make it. It's all about new product development and finding ways to improve existing products. So many things come together in the production process. When you start from scratch, you really need to create everything.
At Antal, just about everything is produced in-house, which allows us to have a complete control over the design and manufacturing of our products. We have several test machines at Antal and take this part of the design and manufacturing process very seriously. Production of a new product will never begin until we are 100% satisfied in the test results. In the event that a product fails to pass a test, we simply go back to the design process and start over. Between the early prototypes and today's current products, we went through quite a bit of adjusting, tweaking and improving. We want to make a difference in the hardware market by molding our products from their very core. We only want to produce first class equipment. Through the development of our clutches, we created a product that can hold up to 1200 kilograms without damaging a 12 mm line. To learn more about Antal classes, visit antal.it.